But bro, you, you've quoted a lot of controversy in the recent past. Um, we'll talk about every controversy that you actually uh, quoted. But we're beginning by Zari Hassan. Somebody says, um, why Zari Hassan? Because he recently took to social media to post this message, and I read, eh? Dear Zari, Jesus loves you so much. Na ame nitumia mimi leo kukwambia kwamba ana mipango poa na wewe. Mimi alinitoa from the streets mahala siku na familia nyumba hata lishe. But now magari hela na amani ni navyo tele. Don't waste time. You never know tomorrow. I love you the same way God loves you. He was faithfully. <laughs> Ring tone. That's a very nice open letter to Zari right there. But um, why Zari Hassan? Uh, as in I, I'm just um, a man of God just trying to pass message. Uh, mm. Right now where our generation or our world is, yeah. we are at the point where um, Christians, instead of going, for example, on social media to preach to another person they think mm. should, should deceive Jesus, they just go on their Instagram they like. Okay. So liking, uh, you've not preached. All right. Okay. Uh, by, uh, I'm a, by liking, you've not mm. uh, testified, uh -huh. you've not shared the, the word of God. So for me, I'm a bit different. You may call it controversy, yes. but I'm, try, I'm, I'm quite sure where Jesus is right mm. now. He's seated and saying, ah, I think Rington, uh, you're doing the right thing. All right, yes. Rington, bono umeona tu saa indo zari anaitaji mungu zaidi baada kwa chana Diamond Platinums? Me, uh, to be honest, I, uh, Zari is beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, to be honest, uh, uh, Zari, uh, she's a great entrepreneur lady. Oh, okay. And uh, she's a, uh, uh, she's, uh, from our region, East African community. Oh, okay. And uh, uh, the reason why I posted or I've been trying to get to her, number one, I've been looking for her number mm. so that I want her to be my friend. And to above all, if God decides that uh, she becomes my wife, mm. why not? Because I'm single, mm. I'm, I'm not married, not yeah. worried, uh, successful, blessed, uh, you know, a man of God, mm. uh, God fearing. Mm. Come on, tall, you know. <laughs> how tall, dark, thing? and handsome. <laughs> all those <laughs> complete package, right? Yes, that's what's up. Okay, mm. that is what is up. You're saying, um, and you recently say that Diamond Blood Namzana Kakitu. Yani my Shazari Hassan expensive. Diamond ali jaribu miaka mitatu. Akashindwa kuendeleza na wewe sasa unaingia. For that one, I didn't say. For that one, I think it's uh, people as in a, is the, the media misquoted you. Is a, a journalist somewhere <laughs> who wanted uh, the story to be juicy. Akasema mm. hivyo. As a man of God, I cannot go out there and say that somebody is broke, somebody doesn't have. Yeah. Because it's God who gives. It's God who blesses people. Today, for me, I remember there's a time I didn't have 20 bob. I used to stay in somebody's house in Buruburu. Yeah. I didn't have 20 bob to come uh, in Agaria 5-8 from Buruburu to town. But today I'm blessed. I, I, I own my own cars. So I can never look down upon somebody that mm. you don't have. Uh, because I know the God who leaves people who, ha who, have, who don't have yeah. is the God who can be able to take somebody who has and make it so that somebody n don't have to, uh, <laughs> and you, you, can, you, you lack you it completely. You can, really make, you can really make a good preacher right No, no, no but it's true. And you said you have a current home, which is just simply waiting for Zari Hassan and the children. No, I have many homes. Mm. I, uh, I used to live in Karen, <laughs> mm -hmm. and I started having problems <laughs> with traffic. Okay. Uh, from Karen to town. So you decided so to... No, I moved to Runda. So Eish. now I stay in Runda. Uh -huh. uh, no, it's not sure. Of. When you're blessed, you're blessed. <laughs> it's, it's just normal. Mm. Why is it that uh, I have a car, people say, oh, you're mm. showing off. But it is true if you have, you have. You have. Uh, and those, those who feel that uh, it's a show off, mm. don't be angry with somebody who has. Just go before God. Ask that person. All right. Who gave you? God gave me. So go before God. Go ask before God, bless God and me say like thank you. And you'll be blessed. All right. Yeah. And, and we'll go to some information about your wealth. But still sticking on matters, Zari Hassan. Have you reached out to her and expressed your interest in her? Uh, uh, I'll be honest that uh, uh, that uh, sh since she comes from East Africa, mm. this story as uh, Tanzanians, have, Tanzanians have been talking about it, Ugandans have been talking about it uh, everywhere. So I think she knows. Um, uh, I'm just uh, uh, I'm just humbly asking her mm. if she wherever she is. Yeah. to consider that she needs a man who is God-fearing, who is tall, uh, who is handsome, <laughs> who knows how to smile, and uh, a man who will not give her trouble. Uh, no, 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 it's okay. Mm. She needs somebody who will not give her trouble, mm. somebody who will lead her to church, okay. uh, who, somebody who will not lead her to 
as na mm. to the wrong things me the only thing i can do is just to lead ch uh, zari chacha alafu unajua nikiangalia zari because she's uh, an entrepreneur yes. anaweza kuwa mama wa kanisa mzuri sana ah. uh, mama wa wazee <laughs> chama za church mwenye atafanya maendeleo kwa kanisa <laughs> analeta maendeleo kabisa yes kwa all right and there's a picture we want to uh, show our viewers at home of you uh, buying uh, cattle cows you say that you bought around 42 cows yes. to take to zari hassan's home in uganda i believe we have those pictures on your screens and was that a publicity stand do you have the cows and where are they being kept <laughs> the cows are in, uh, in one of my pieces of land in current <laughs> 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 yeah <laughs> Alright, so so leo wako leta Of course I will do. We'll do that. Actually in the two Waganda most of Ugandans uh, you know my music is, <coughs> is is popular in Uganda and mm. I have a lot of fans there. So my fans in Uganda have been sending me messages saying ah why why 42? Wananiambia siju the other guy paid 100. Utaongeza? No big deal. Uh, okay. uh, the, uh, no. no Kenyans, Kenyans, you're blessed. All right, no mm -hmm. big deal. Rington says no big deal right there. And uh, we are yet to go to uh, his uh, source of wealth, but let us listen to what Zari said in regards to getting into a new relationship. Um, uh, she had, uh, she did an interview with the BBC recently, and she said this. Let us listen. Yeah. No, I'm not looking. <laughs> <laughs> Look, love, love will sweep you off your feet at unexpected places, at mm. unexpected times. So you can never say never. Like in this time, Saivi, I'm trying to find myself. Because when you're in a relationship, most of the time when you're in a relationship, you lose yourself as an individual in the relationship. Mm -hmm. So for me this time, it's about finding myself. But Saivi... Uh, I'm not, I'm not looking, like in mutu akitokea, yani mutu flani akitokea na, because saivi, vile nime baba watuta wamefariki, kukawa nime date, hapo mtu kabla sija mdate baba ti, so saivi, baba ti katoka, tena watutu wanaona kuna mtu mwingine, yani itakuwa, it's also traumatizing for them. I think I need to be off the dating scene for a while. All right, that is Zari Hassan right there. Anasema kwamba Rington, hataki mausiano yoyote. Sae ni familia yake, watoto wake watano, hataki kuintroduce baba mwingine kwa watoto wake watano. Uh, let me tell you, mm. in life we plan. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes uh, we do a lot of things. We say we'll do this and we won't do that. Mm. But you see, in all our plans, uh, the Bible says that we should submit our plans to God. Okay. And God has the last word. Mm. Let me tell you. God changed Saul to Paul. Mm. Okay? Uh, Saul was a terrorist. He became the greatest minister. Yeah. Uh, for me, I'm looking at a situation where, uh, number one, uh, we understand Zari. Like um, a man who is, uh, who is caring, I understand mm. what she's been through. It's, it's not a small thing. Yeah. Moving from this relationship to, to another, another bad relationship. Um, not a bad relationship, per se. Uh, all right. Mm. I, I, I'm not quoting myself. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> quoting her from the okay. interview. Mm -hmm. Okay, you know somebody, a man disrespecting you, All right. uh, you know, um, and you know, you have kids. So, it, it, that's a bad relationship okay. to say. But now, moving from this one to this, uh, mm -hmm. this other one, so the, the third one should be better. Okay. And let me tell you, mm -hmm. uh, as a Christian, yeah. I believe that number three is yeah. a number of perfection. <laughs> so for, for Zari... <laughs> no, no, it's true. Mm -hmm. So for Zari, she's been in number one, uh, which was how it was. Number two which was complicated yeah. and a world a world relationship so number three is a number of completion so number three zari is moving oh, okay. to a man of god and uh -huh. zari will be a, a, a will be a church woman uh -huh. you know she an like entrepreneur no no no. let me tell you uh -huh. uh, you didn't show the viewers that uh, she's been to church in south africa before oh she's posted videos research, in church bro. no but this is true <laughs> uh -huh. uh, she's been to church before taking kids to church okay so it, it is it, uh, what i'm saying is not something that will not happen yeah. zari has shown intent that she loves God All she, right. now she's moving from the world and moving to church so me I'm coming as a man of God Who? coming to encourage her okay that even if I don't become her, 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 her husband, her husband mm. but I would still be praying that I'm uh, and I want her to be a woman of God so and I, but my prayers uh -huh. I'll tell you ever since I was a kid uh -huh. everything I've prayed for just has happened. happened 
Okay, you, uh, I'll get in right there. You are saying ever since you were a kid, everything that you prayed for happened. Yes. And you said you prayed for AC to be your wife, but that has not happened. I didn't, pr I didn't say that. <laughs> I never You're said. Denying. No, no, no. I didn't. I, uh, 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 do you have a clip you can play for the viewers to Actually, see where I said that? Actually, that was an exclusive I didn't interview you did with myself. And no, you no, said no. that you're really praying for AC to be your wife. I didn't and say that. And somebody will say, I ringtone. Say Leo unaonyesha mapenzi kwa RC kikiumana unachoka mm -mm. unaenda kwa Zari. I will say mm. I will tell you this. What happened I did it, I didn't say that. Mm. Let me tell you. Mm. Racy is my friend. Mm. Uh, and uh, I was praying for her. Uh, Racy's mother is a is a, a staunch Christian. Yeah. She's a very prayerful woman. Yeah. I've been to Tanzania. Racy has come to see me. Uh, we met. No, it's true. <laughs> it's true as friends. Okay. Uh -huh. Are we not supposed to have friends as Christians? I should be. Yeah, I should no, be no. friends. Racy mm. was going through a, a, a situation mm. because of her situation that we understand yeah. that I wouldn't want to to demean her using mm -hmm. the situation. So, uh, Racy, I was praying for her to, uh, to to come to God, like the mother, okay. her mother is praying for and, her. And uh, is she on the path of yeah, she's going to God? She's a Christian. All right, amazing. Yeah. And now we're wrapping up on uh, issues of love with Rington, and we're going to this uh, big monster in the room, the source of his wealth. Rington, to Nakuona, Ukona Do. I love recently, Ulisema Kwamba, you, uh, you've budgeted around 150 million to 200 million shillings for a chopper. And now we are asking, where, what is your source of wealth? Um, uh, okay, number one, uh, it's just because I'm not selfish. I wouldn't have told you because uh, then you will have other people uh, be being like me. Mm. Uh, maybe some other who will use my ideas and become uh, rich. <laughs> they, maybe they will come and show off and, you know, abuse me. But anyway, because I'm a man of God and I'm mm. not selfish, I'll just say. Yeah. Because, uh, you know, God will give me other different, better ideas. All right. So this is what I did. I, I used to have a Toyota Celica. Oh, okay. This car, mm. uh, I'd just come from America, yeah. where I'd been on tour. So when I came back to Kenya, my, the, peop the people I left my car with misused my car until it only had one gear. Okay. It didn't have a reverse. Mm -hmm. Gear one, mm. two, three. Uh, actually, it had two gears. It had mm. gear number one and gear number five. Okay. So uh, now, that time when I came back, because I had a lot of things to do with my money, I spent mm. money. I didn't have money. Mm. I was staying in Comarok in a, a one bedroom house and be brief because my director tells me time is almost up uh -huh. okay so uh, i was i was staying in a one bedroom house yeah. in Comarok. i didn't have money so i went to borrow somebody to give me money to buy a gearbox a gearbox was costing forty five thousand. Uh -huh. that person lent me seven thousand okay i asked myself what can i do with seven thousand uh -huh. will i stay in the house until i get the money no i said i'll do something mm. i decided to go with my car that was spoiled mm. i started visiting high schools so i went to school I, the seven thousand i borrowed i made cds uh -huh. I, I i went i started from karatina yeah. i moved to schools around central uh, all the way to meru mm. and to th uh, and to to be brief in a span of two months i had uh, made 1.8 million from mm. from selling cds C for selling cds because in a span of two months yeah so 1.8 million that's around 900,000 yeah. per month a school has probably a thousand to eight hundred or one thousand two hundred kids and which kind uh, of cds were you selling my music vcds the, the teachers don't have a problem with a christian musician who who looks like a role model you see like me All i right, don't have uh, a lot of stuff let me chip in mm. so your songs were that big at that particular time when you said uh cds and make around 900k i made my first month? i made my first national hit mm. called gospel in Nabamba in 2006. Okay. So I've been in the game and okay. I've been big all this time. So so the long and short of this is that the source of your wealth is your music. It's my music and other things I create. I, I, I music. really want to know the other things. What, what no. are the other things? Right, currently I, I'm in the hospitality industry. I own a hotel. I, <laughs> I, I have companies. I do tenders. I, you know, I, I'm just being a young man who knows how to use his name. So you are a young, rich entrepreneur? I, I am not rich. I, I am, you know, to be rich is to be filled by, be, with God's love. So actually, I have God's love, so I'm rich. So you are rich. Money, you can never have enough. There are people who have billions and billions. I'm not a billionaire. Okay. I just have enough so to, to do my stuff, to bless people and do good to my, to my life. All right. So let's take a look at um, a picture you shared on social media some time back where you said that you, you are actually asking your fans whether you should go for that particular chopper. It is right there on your screen. That is the chopper you said you wanted to buy. And my question to you, have mm. you acquired it? And do you have the 200 million that you're budgeting for to buy that chop, uh, chopper? I, I am in, I'm in the process of finishing a certain deal, uh -huh. uh, which somebody has already paid little. Uh -huh. uh, and as I finish that deal, 
then I buy this, I, I, I conclude this is the deal. But I'm in the process of doing it. I told you and mm. I warn you that ever since I was a street mm. boy with no mother, no father on the street, mm. eating from the trash bin, right. everything and anything I've ever prayed for, mm. no, no, no matter how weird it looks, yes. I've always achieved it. Okay. Mm. Uh, Diamond Blood Mums uh, once uh, gave an exclusive interview, I think on the BET, and he revealed his net worth. Mm. What is your net worth, Rington? What did Diamond say? Diamond Blanham said he was worth around 400 million shillings. That is back in 2015. Huh. What is your net worth, Rington? Okay. Uh, for me, I don't know what my net worth is, but I, I over, think... Uh, okay, give us a, a figure. Over 300 million, over 400 million, over 500, over a billion? No, no, no. Probably I could be double diamond. <laughs> um, yeah. All right. Uh, double diamond blood numbers. That's around over 800 million shillings, you're saying? Yeah, I can afford a chopper. Mm. I can afford good life. I can afford uh, to, mm. to, to, you know, I, I think I'm worth good enough. All right. That is Rington. Alex Apoko right there saying he is worth more than 800 million shillings. And it will be unfair for me to push him this much without giving him some time to probably give a word of advice to the youth out there and tell us what are his, what are his plans, especially in the music uh, world. Rington, so to and Gomako next, Unatoa Linine, and which kind of uh, advice do you have for the youth out there who look up to you, this young, uh, almost a billionaire, you say? Uh, not, uh, no, uh, I, would, I don't like going in terms of uh, wealth. Eh? Mm. It looks a shock. But uh, in terms of ministry, this is what I, wa I want to advise the young mm. people out there. I never had it. Today I have it. Mm. No, why? Uh, not because I sat down, I prayed, and mm. manna fell from heaven. Mm. Um, uh, a wise man said uh, yeah. that uh, you will never know how to ride a bicycle by reading a book. Okay. You want to be a, b a great businessman, you step into business. Mm. You make losses, don't give up. You'll get it. Now, for me, uh, many of the vi business ventures I've tried, mm. even trying to make good music. And bro, be, br be very brief, Nambiwa, time in a song. Okay. Um, I think then I will be able to come another day. I'll just finish by saying, mm -hmm. telling the young people, when you try something and you don't get it right, and you don't get the right results, don't give up. Rington tried many, many times uh, to get to where he is today. And uh, life is not about, okay. success is not about the cars, the houses, mm. and the big things mm. you have. Success is about achieving your dreams. So there are people who are born be with cars, with whatever. Yeah. So they, they wouldn't be successful. They thank have better you. dreams to achieve. So it's All about achieving your dreams. All right. Dreams. Uh, thank you very much, Rington. That is Rington for us. And he's actually given us information a lot about himself, including that he is worth over 800 million shillings. We didn't know that. Hmm. And that is going to get a <laughs> chopper very soon worth over 200 million shillings. And that Zari Hassan, despite saying she is not ready for a, re for a relationship, Rington says he won't give up. He'll still reach out to her and probably bring her to the godly ways. That has been my time on Season Extra Trends. My name is Brenna Koth. As I hand you back to Ego Maura, Higgs, take it away and probably give me one word of what you've gathered from all this interview, bro. I only wonder how much he pays KRA every year.